What's good, Raider Nation? Y'all know who it is and y'all know what it is. It's your boy, Matthew Shack, uh, live here in Los Angeles. And uh, I had to pull over, man, because I just found out that uh, um, rookie cornerback and defensive stalwart Nate Hobbs, after landing and getting back to Las Vegas after that great win yesterday against Indianapolis, got arrested for DUI. Four o'clock in the morning, Cromwell Hotel, witnesses say that his car was parked on the exit, exit ramp of the parking lot or the parking access, um, and he was asleep at the wheel. Got arrested. Um, Rich Passaccia came out and had uh, a statement in regards to it. Um, but once again, it's like, man, uh, there's no real leadership. Now, when I say that, it's on offense and defense because this is the third, what's the third DUI situation that's happened in the calendar year. Uh, a, a year ago this month is Josh Jacobs. Rugs, you know, week seven. It's January, barely. That's three young players that are under the age of 25. Not counting Damon Arnett's meltdown. Uh, you know, there's, there's no leadership that's off the field with these guys. You know, outside of what Mad Max uh, and and what Darren Waller was doing in regards to trying to, um, they're older, trying to you know stay stay uh, sober and and you know and stay on the proper path. Um, they're kids, man. Kids aren't apt to listen to anybody. You know what I'm saying? And it just co goes to show you that there's definitely not no disciplinarian that has to do with the franchise at this point. It's no disciplinarian. Uh, if your friend who's on your team, who is going to be on trial for his life, if that didn't wake your ass up and somebody dying behind the wheel and then having your other teammate uh, damn near hurt him and kill himself in the car, uh, you know, allegedly. And then you do the same thing. What, what are you to do? You know what I'm saying? People are going to want to blame Vegas. People are going to want to say, you know, hey, it was a bad idea for Vegas and this, that, and the other. But nah, man, these kids' habits, uh, they've been like that. You know, you just don't start doing crazy stuff like that. You just don't start driving under the influence just today. Nah, that's stuff that you've been doing. You've been doing that since high school, since the keg parties. You've been doing that since the toga parties in college. You've been doing that. You've been doing this since you've been in Vegas. Other cities have the same problem, but it's exacerbated because it's it's Las Vegas. Um, as far as the football is concerned, man, uh, I don't know what's going to happen, man. I don't think the NFL is going to be swift to uh, to come to some kind of punishment for Hobbs uh, because there has to be a whole you know legal proceeding and all this kind of stuff. Uh, I think uh, unless Mark Davis and um, Mike Mayock decide to do some uh, you know, some internal, uh, some internal uh, punishments. I don't think anything's going to go down that quick, but it just is disappointing, man, it's to have another one of your, your players who has so much potential and so much promise uh, put himself in harm's way. I just thank God that he wasn't hurt. Thank God nobody else got hurt. But there's, this is egregious beyond egregious because it's like, dude, you already know what it's about. You want to have a good time, man. Where's the designated driver at, man? Where's the Uber? Where's the Uber driver at? Where's the limo driver at? You know, damn. There's there's probably Raider fans that was at the crime wheel that would have drove you to where you needed to go. But like I said, man, youthful youthful exuberance will turn into youthful arrogance, and that's what it's gonna be, man. So, hey, man, I'm still not gonna try to make this and. Uh, a big deal in regards to what we got to do but it doesn't make it any easier man to know that cats ain't focused man like come on dog we 
let's let's get to off season for you guys to do all of that. But nope. Their habits are their habits. And until they unlearn their habits or until they have proper leadership in place or a disciplinarian in place to curb this. It's going to keep happening, man. We just got to hope that nobody else loses their life over it. All right, man. Love all y'all out there, man. It's still Raider Nation on ours, man. We got some problem kids in the house, man. It's time It's time to start disciplining these kids, man. Unfortunately, got to do something. Can't let the next uh, draft picks that are going to be here in a few months think that this is how it's done. Bad luck. Salute.